Hey, what's up, everybody? We're from Street Kids in New York. Today we're going to review Jordan 11. These are the red 11s. These are coming out uh, next Friday, which is December 21st. Uh, color on the box black, varsity red, and white. Box price is $185. The price went up from la um, last year $5. Okay, these probably are definitely the most anticipated uh, Jordan release, I guess, the 11. So there's nothing that beats these shoes out as far as sales and and, uh, and demand. Um, it's definitely, I guess, it is uh, probably, in my opinion, too, it's probably one of the better Jordans. Um, and this is one of the original colorways. These, these are the breads. Uh, it's a good looking shoe. Um, I'll just give you a brief history. Like I said, it came out in 95, 96. It's another Tinker Hatfield shoe. Um, he. Um, he themed it after uh, he got um, direction from a, a, a car, which is what the patent leather is supposed to be, the metal, and with the Cordura here, um, it's supposed to be like the, the, the drop top on a car for convertible, and then also uh, um, also for a lawnmower. So he kind of took it from from both uh, both ideas. But uh, that's where the history is. Uh, like I said, it's definitely a, definitely one of the better shoes that, that was made, um, probably if not the best um, for Jordan 11. But here it is. So you got your patent leather all the way around, toe box, side panels. Again, here's that Cordura um, insert here with the uh, basketball hoop laces. This shoe has a Zoom Air technology. Uh, it was made lightweight. Um, it was a, there was a lot of uh, a lot of technology that went into this uh, Jordan 11. Um, so um, it was just not just for the just for the fashion uh, tuxedo look, but um, a lot of uh, a lot of technology in it. Uh, anyway, here you got your red jumpman back here. Your 23 here. Uh, what's inside here? Okay, quality basketball. Uh, product inspired by the greatest player ever. Right there on the tongue. They also put the. Uh, you know what I didn't even mention too. They went back. This they used the original thumb pit, uh, thumb print box, regular black Jordan box. They didn't give us that other. Uh, those. Um, slide box. Um, I think it would have been a little bit nicer to have that box, but it's not going to take away from the shoe anyway, but I'll just make a point of that. They did give, uh, well, I didn't show you this, they did give you the plastic insert, it has the Jordan 11 in there, and it's got a little writing on that paper too in there, but I'll just show you that. Um, they also put this, for the integrity of the shoe, they put this plastic, hard plastic, to keep the, to keep it in that toe box so it doesn't wrinkle. This shoe doesn't wrinkle that bad anyway, so that was one of the advantages of the patent leather. Anyway, um, then you got uh, the symbol here, that Greek symbol here, the Jordan here. Um, what else? Yeah. The, cord, the, the tongue is also that Cordura. You know, it's like the Cordura is just a strong material, lightweight, um, that was used on it. The bottoms, show you the bottoms again. Uh, this is a carbon fiber plate. You got your red, your black. A little white in that midsole. Uh, I think the midsole here was, uh, yeah, this is Molo DVA midsole they used on this. So uh, made, made it a little bit softer feel than that polyurethane. But definitely a great looking shoe. Um, I had a, um, I actually had a, um, uh, from the package, because this shoe came out originally to back in 95, 96. I know it was retroed in 2001 and 2008. Um, and I actually have a 2008 here behind the counter. Uh, Marcel, do me a favor. Give me that 2008 underneath the counter, a size 11. I give a shout out to my um, friend Russ. He just he dropped it off for me, so I wanted to see if there's any difference in it, and it seemed to be pretty, pretty, pretty close. Um, so in 09, you had the Space Jams. 10, you had the Cool Grays. Uh, I think in the Silver Anniversaries, I think also it was 010. 11, the Concords, and now the Breads. So this is like the fourth year. I just want to show you. This is the shoe. I don't want to get it dirty, but just to pop it a little fast. It definitely isn't identical. There's, there's nothing different. Nothing different. If you want to take a quick peep. And it, this is a size 11, so it's a little bit bigger. But as far as everything, it's exact. Uh, the workmanship seems to be um, definitely good on these, and I think it was the same on these too. There's nothing. Nothing was different. You know, the leather back here, which is the same, nice soft leather. Yeah, the, everything was the same. I went over the shoe pretty well, um, but it's exactly the same. And uh, so what else? Yes, that's it. This is the, this is the shoe that caused all the the problems. But hopefully this year it'll be a little more controlled and people will get a chance to get them. Um, Nike also makes you know all their clothing with it. Um, this is a, a hat that comes with it. 
Uh, this hat, I believe, was thirty dollars, thirty-four dollars. That's yeah, Jordan hat to match up with it. And they make a little different, different twist. They add the socks. You can get a little sock for 20, 20 bucks. That matches it. And this is a uh, Christmas stocking with a knit hat in here. This is $45. This is a little pricey for it, but I mean, the hat, of course, is usable. It's a nice hat to match with it. Um, the stocking, I guess, if you're getting somebody for Christmas present, you can stick that in there. And I'm sure, that's what they're getting for Christmas, but that's a $45 hookup on this. So it's pretty cool. And they got uh, one sweatsuit. Let me get it, grab it real fast. Grab a couple of tees too. But this is the Jordan sweatsuit that goes with it. They made this suit. You kind of see the resemblance here for the um, material, for the Cordura material. Uh, the pants are 75. The top, the top is 90. It's got a hood on it. Uh, pretty cool looking suit. It's got the uh, backwards grip riding right here to match up with the tone of the tongue. So that's the suit right there, and I know I'm giving you a lot of stuff, but they make a lot of stuff to go with this shoe. Um, there's a $30 t-shirt right there that again matches that like Jordan symbol there. He's got the OG 1995, black, true, red, white. So again, the 95-96 So there you go. Uh, that's your Jordan 11. Uh, hope everybody, everybody has a chance to get a pair. And there's no other additions to this video. Uh, no other um, shoes I took those up last week. And that's it. Take a last look at these Jordan 11s. Brad, streak you out.